go. This is one of the landmark buildings in the Lincolnville neighborhood in the nation's oldest city of St. Augustine, Florida. It was built in 1926. It's actually three connected buildings. This one behind us was a nursing home. Uh, the middle one was showers, and the other part of the building was a community house that provided meeting spaces for many black organizations during the age of segregation. It was a gift of our famous philanthropist, Dr. Andrew Anderson, who was on a crusade in the last decade of his life to put works of art in public places. The last one he gave were the famous marble lion statues on our historic Bridge of Lions. After it ceased to be used as a nursing home, it was taken over by the venerable black educator, Mrs. Rosalie Gordon Mills, who rechristened it as Echo House and used it as community meeting space and the Lincolnville Public Library. Uh, Mrs. Mills was a historic figure herself. She became the first black woman in 400 years to run for public office when she sought a seat on the St. Augustine City Commission in 1965. This building is the work of one of two great 20th century architects, Fred Hendrick, who was a pioneer of the Mediterranean Revival style with its uh, shell dash stucco finish on the walls and the inevitable red tile roof up above. It's one of the wonderful contributing buildings to a National Register Historic District and it really needs to be saved and preserved. Mrs. Mills lived to be almost 97 years old, but she could not in her last years keep up the building, so it is a charge that she left to us to see that this wonderful landmark is preserved and not lost for the future.